this home behind me on the corner of Park Avenue and Long Street in Kelowna is about to be demolished. Nothing new or unusual about that, except this home is on the city's Heritage Registry. Now, Heritage Registry homes can be demolished, as City Council found out Monday, much to their distaste, because Heritage Registry homes are also afforded some opportunities that you or I don't have, such as access to the city's Heritage Grant Program. The previous homeowners in 2017 received $7,500 to replace the roof. Now, the the home is apparently unlivable and will be destroyed and a new home of similar look will be built in its place. However, Mayor Colin Bazaran says he struggled with his decision. I understand the passion of the people who live in and want to see the protection of the heritage conservation area and, and I understand that. And I also recognize that under our current system, as I mentioned, it's at the whim of the individual property owner uh, whether or not the house will be protected. Councillor Gail Given, who did vote against uh, removing the home from the registry, says there is a difference between the heritage registry and actual heritage protection. My concern is that it has the, a, a rating of 71 out of 100 in our heritage committee, who we strike to provide us with good advice, believes this property needs to remain on the heritage register but it sounds like that alone doesn't protect the house that we would actually have to seek a heritage designation and that would be us imposing something on a property owner. Mayor Bazaran says under the current system it's all up to the property owner whether they want to protect a heritage home or not and council agreed that they need to talk about the current system and changes need to be made to protect heritage homes in the city. Wayne Moore, Castanet News on Park Avenue.